Now, there was some dry weather and some sunshine around that this morning. Is it going to continue here, Shafali? <laughs> well, one of those, certainly. Thank you very much, Becky. Hello, good afternoon to you. Well, it was a chilly old night last night, certainly for certain sheltered pockets of the region, the Black Country, parts of Staffordshire uh, being uh, two of those areas. We had lows about three Celsius last night, and there was a touch of frost, some ice as well. But it has been largely dry and a beautiful sunny start to the day, as Becky was saying. But uh, we have got some cloud to come for the next few days. We'll be chasing cloud, but it's going to be mainly settled. Whether that cloud is thicker, we could just set off the odd shower, perhaps. But it's going to be generally cool with temperatures below average and calm. The winds are going to be calming down. Uh, we are seeing quite a noticeable breeze today from that northeasterly direction. And that's what's drawing in the cloud from off the North Sea. But it stays mainly dry. We've just got a few showers along the spine of the country which aren't affecting us yet. So we'll see highs about 12 to 14 Celsius where the sun shines. But it's through tonight where we start to see more of that cloud filtering in from that direction. And that's just going to draw in a few showers into southeastern parts. But you can see temperatures are on the low side once again to about 2 Celsius in certain places. Rurally, they will be even lower than that. So uh, no doubt there will be a touch of frost into the morning tomorrow. But tomorrow overall a cloudier day. That cloud's thick enough to produce and push out the odd shower, but mainly dry with highs of 30. Thanks, Shafali. That is all for now. Mary Rhodes will be back at half past six on BBC One. But from me and all the lunchtime team here, have a very good afternoon. Bye for now.